Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of From the Depths. I'm Exterminator, and thanks for joining me. So, uh, I just launched up the game here, and we have a Strength 35 fleet that was heading for our uh, satellite here. And, uh, yeah, so I have to run and intercept it with, uh, with our air fleet here. So, I was going to start out by spawning in quite a few things, but that obviously is not the case. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and do this battle, and then, uh, obviously on screen, I'm not going to skip it. But, uh, do this, and then spawn stuff in, and then go engage in another battle, and that is my plan for this episode. Hopefully things go well and this battle doesn't take like 15 minutes, <laughs> like the last one. So, let's, uh, let's go ahead and engage. This time I'll actually do it when I'm closer. <laughs> so this is a new feature. The game updated, um, before I played. Yes. So now we're blockaded. Okay, so I don't think I can go any closer at this point. Okay. So, at this point, I'm ready to engage. And let's see, Condor... Um, no, we definitely want the Sky Buccaneer in first, because he's our main, our main unit here. Go ahead and do that, do that. That actually looks like a pretty good order to me. And, uh, I can't bump this up, which is kind of weird. Shit. I didn't want that. What? What the fuck? Oh, what? I want that at 25. Oh, shit. Well, oh well. <laughs> I guess we'll figure out what happens next. So the lag begins. Let's go ahead and warp to him. Oh wow, so we're like right on top of them. Holy, holy crap. Oh man. Now he's firing up, but I mean, d these, uh... <laughs> Sorry dude, your guns do not have enough arc to hit my stuff. The lag is pretty intense. I think almost all of our stuff spawned in, even though that block limit was lower. Oh, that might hit him. Nope, nice dodge. Definitely a nice dodge. Now, this is really the main unit, so they're being smart and focusing it, although... <laughs> Our Sky Buccaneer is, um, wrecking these dudes with bombs. Oh man, already hits an ammo supply here, right on its roof. Oh, oh my god, that is so cool to watch. Man, I love that thing. I'm so glad, like, I'm so glad I did this series with submitting, with, where people submit community vehicles. This is just so much better than me trying to build like really crappy things <laughs> that would take forever. Um, this is just so cool. I love seeing all these designs. So he's too damaged. Now this view is um, this view is kind of interesting. Ah oh, shit. See, so that we actually have this like thing here, like a spyglass or something, and then you can like zoom in. I'm not gonna do that. I'd rather watch it through this view. So he just blew up. Um, all our stuff is at hundred percent. I mean. <laughs> These battles, even against these, like, higher strength things are, I mean, they seem pretty one-sided, to be honest. Although, I mean, the Onyx Watch, they, uh, they do pretty much only use cannons, so, and we have a lot of shielding, so that pretty much just negates their effectiveness. Um, I think things later on that use lasers and a lot of missiles and stuff, um, would do a lot better against our current, um, armament here, but, uh, it'll all get upgraded, obviously. There's so many new designs... I want to I want to load a lot in this episode. I wish there was a way to like Maybe there is and I'm just really dumb. I wish there was a way to like when you load in a vehicle um through the spawner to like um speed that up. If you know what I mean, so you could like like hit a button or like select in the option thing for the vehicle spawner to like build it at like two times speed or whatever. Because um, for bigger vehicles, it does take quite a while to um, to fully spawn them in. Now, I think there's like keys that you can actually speed the whole game up with, but I don't really want to mess with that. Oh, there's the bombs. <laughs> Things already gone. Battle's finished. 
So uh, that that went pretty well. And I'm, I don't, I'm almost thinking I want to um, I wanted to keep all my air units together, but what I'm actually thinking is I've been wanting to take the helicopter out of this and put it in one of these because I think that's what's slowing this down because the um, our fleet here, our air fleet only moves at 15 and a half uh, meters a second, which for the air fleet is very, very slow. You can see here 95, 90, 45, 90. so it's this thing here that slows us down. So what I think I want to do is I'm going to go ahead and we're going to pull him out. I think either put him with the boats or the submarines. I think the boats might be a little better of an idea. So what I want to do is actually pull these guys. I can actually pull. I can just pull everything. Get him close here and then um, then go ahead and do this. So, well, actually, let me get him close so I'm not like dealing with tons of different fleets here. But, uh, yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do because I, I want our air our air unit um, here, our air fleet, to be able to get somewhere quickly. And uh, that's kind of not happening right now. So if you're like there, okay, so then I want a helicopter, split these forces into a new fleet, perfect. Okay, fleets, what, fleets. Oh, okay, I see. So this keeps changing a little bit. A little confusing each time, but uh, not... A bit... Okay, never mind. Sorry, I'm just really stupid. Ignore me. <laughs> Merge. Why do we have so many different fleets? Crap, did I just fucking... Son of a... God... Damn it. <laughs> Why did I do that? I think I just split the entire fleet into all different kinds of stuff. Shit. Okay, I want you. What? Okay, well, let's do... Oh, yeah. Yeah, see? Ah, oh, shit. Okay, you go this way. You go over here. You go this way. Oh, so you guys... Okay, so you're there. Hold on, what's this? Oh, the Phoenix. Okay, you guys get out of here. I don't want you interfering with all this okay and then we're gonna spawn stuff in so let me get him closer so we can kind of spawn stuff in like that okay so now I need to go into fleets and I need to have you merge with the sky buccaneer and I need to have you guys merge with the condor and you guys merge with the ragjet correct correct so I need to be more careful instead of each into a new fleet. I don't want to do that. I'll have to look that up because this used to be where I could just split the thing off, but now it's going to split everything in here out, which is definitely not what I want at all. Hmm. Okay, well, let's go ahead and. Alright, got there. Okay. Make sure none of my stuff is under attack here. Okay, we're good. Deepwater Guard is just like gone. <laughs> they're just, they're pretty much screwed. All right, so let's go ahead and spawn you in. Warp to you. All right, so new units. Um, one, the, the same person who made the Sky Buccaneer, he has, he submitted quite a few things, and that's the only thing I spawned in of his. Um, and again, it's absolutely nothing personal against the vehicles or the creators is just like I said I don't remember which person submitted each individual vehicle but I was provided a list so let's go ahead the Matilda um, I think is the cheapest and the weakest of them and like I said I do want to spawn in the kind of lower units um, now so we're not in a situation I've, I've gone over many times where we're spawning in like weak stuff later and we have super super strong stuff now it just what the hell wow okay so let's go ahead and spawn this guy in first and actually what I want to do is just hold unit until it's 100% complete that may make it so it doesn't let it go so soon someone's just that so let's go ahead and spawn that in 
Um, I'm wondering if, like, will more repair tentacles maybe make this go faster? Or does it just not really matter at that point? Could add more. And I think you can, like, stack these, actually. This might build faster than we think. Or not. Okay. Well, while he's building, it's kind of nighttime. He's building. Let's um see if I can add a few more. What would this be under miscellaneous? Oh, damn it! Now, can these stack? I wonder. Okay, they cannot stack stack on each other. I don't believe. No. Okay. Well, I guess. Well, these are actually kind of just sitting here. It's a little hard to see in the dark, actually. Okay, well, they're just kind of on the edge, so... Damn it, game. I don't... There we go. I haven't built something in so long, I forget all the controls. Holy crap. Hmm. Nope, there you are. Alright. So, I don't know if these make it really any faster, or I'm just, like, really dumb. Okay. What? Oh. Okay, wow, okay. So, is this a airship? Or a ship ship? Really not entirely sure. 57%. I don't know if these are actually helping. Let's hope he doesn't stick out back anymore because we're going to run in to... I mean, now this... Now this is something I do... Oh, shit. Why do I always do that? I always do that. I always do that. Why do I always do that? Screw you. Anyway, what I was saying is this thing's limit for how far away it is is kind of annoying. I have it maxed out and a lot of times it still wants to build like into this thing. Okay, nice. Okay, so I think it is a like an actual ship. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and... What's going on under here? Okay, so this is just like a... Counterweight ballast, whatever you call it, to balance it out. Um, nice. Multiple cannons. I think these are spares crates, right? Yep. This is pretty cool. This actually looks like a legitimate pirate ship, which is um, pretty awesome. Um, it's got a seat. Awesome. So I can actually warp to it. And oh, is, is it done? Oh, okay. It's done. Let's go Go ahead and release you off. And I'm going to spawn in one more thing, I think. Oh, this could be dangerous. You better get out of the way. Um... I really don't know what a lot of these things are. Athena Zero. I need to like go through the whole thread again and just like look at what each thing is. I've deleted a lot of the things we've already spawned in, but uh, this is made by the same person. I think this is oh shit. I think this is a more expensive one. Dude, you better watch where you're going. I think maybe I need to um take this out of play because <laughs> things are getting a little bit dangerous here in fact I guess now would maybe be a good time you okay never mind sorry this does what I thought it did I'm I'm sorry this does what I thought it did it's just I usually do it when it's only these two in the fleet so it does what I want it to do normally it would really mess things up so So everything's good. Everything is fine. Um, support oh wow, that's really that's actually really cool. You can do that. Um, where are our ships? This way? Oh, this way. Now you're kind of slow. You're actually going to really slow this down. I'm afraid. Oh well. Ok, 
Okay, so he's heading off. Let's go ahead and spawn in. I'm interested what this is. Is that that helicopter again? <laughs> I don't remember. Some of these actually aren't even... Now that is a big ass ship. I know what this is. That is, um... Let's get the, um, where is it, where is it? Here's an actual, here's another submarine. I think. Oh wait, maybe not. I don't remember. Um. Oh, well why don't we just spawn in my thing? That's actually far more expensive than I thought. Okay, let's get the, uh, the Black Hawk in. He's an air unit. Ambusher. Well, let's start with the Black Hawk, see what we got here. I think this may also be made by the same person. So, we'll do that, and then maybe one last kind of cheap one. Um, or maybe we'll just go to a battle with this. Um, I don't know. And I I do want to let you guys know, I do plan to do fleet colors, I really do. Um, problem is, the deal is, I've uh, I've been really, like really busy like the last two weeks i've had a we've had a lot of house guests and uh an old friend of mine just left like a couple days ago from us hanging out for a few days and we have more house guests coming like now like today and <laughs> but after that after they leave it's pretty much back to schedule so my point is for fleet colors is not something i want to like do on screen like choosing them because it will take forever and i'm like really indecisive with that kind of stuff so, uh, it's actually really cool, by the way. But, um, but yeah, I want to do it off screen. It's just, it would probably take me a good 30, 40 minutes to set everything up. And I've just, I've been really pressed for time. So I just want to let you know, um, you know, I've heard you guys suggest that. I definitely plan to do it. I agree it's a good idea. Um, it's just, I've been really busy. So after the guests leave, which is like at the end of this weekend, I will, uh, I'll try to get that done. And, um, I could, I could load the save onto my other computer, which I'm on when I have more free time, um, and do it there. But, uh, what else? I need to go into the vehicle designer and load in all these vehicles that I have not spawned in yet that I don't remember what exactly they are. I need to load them in and, like, make a note. Holy shit. The fuck. Go. Brit row. I think this thing's broken, guys. Oh no. Oh no! What are you doing? Um, I need to load in the ones that I don't know what they are and kind of, well, and just, you know, see what they are and then, like, make a note or whatever. So when I'm doing this spawning in, I know what to do. And this, um, I may have to take them out of play and put them back into play and, like, change the elevation or something. Because this is not good. These balloons. I think he's missing balloons potentially. Um, hmm. Then that's kind of unfortunate. Let's um pull you out of play. And where are you? Altitude. Let's have you spawn at like a hundred. So now, if I put you into play. Okay, now you're good to go. Alright, so now when I spawn him in, he should be at a higher altitude, and that's what I want. Very cool looking. I think for now, we're just going to go find another battle here. I might... I don't know, am I out of time? I'm probably out of time. I'm pretty much out of time. Damn it all to hell. Alright, well, we had one battle. We spawned in a few things. Okay, well then, let's actually spawn in something else, rather than going to another battle, because that will take quite a while, since all that's left are, like, really big forces. Um... Next time we'll do more battles. Let's go ahead and spawn in. What do I want? In terms of, like, do I want submarines? Oh, crap. A new submarine was just submitted. And I, I can't remember, was it the, um, the eagle fish or was that a boat? It's very expensive, whatever it is. 
Okay, well, let's see what the... Um, not that. Where? What? What is? What is this? Is this the, the, the little helicopter again? Probably. <laughs> in which case, I'm gonna have to get rid of it instantly. I don't think I have this spawned in though. I'm actually not entirely sure what this is, but um. Delphinus, something. What? 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 What are we spawning? What is? MFs. Zero. Is that like the same thing as um? Where'd it go? The light fighter. No, nope, that's not. That's not what I want. You stupid thing. Where are my air units? Okay. What? This like this looks like the light fighter to me. I think it's like an upgraded version of it. Hmm. Interesting. So, that may have been something we already... I think that's something we already had spawned in, and it's under a different name, which is a little bit unfortunate, because I, I want to spawn in new things, obviously. Um, let's spawn in... Where the hell did it go? I put... Did I not put it in here? One of my units that someone, like, retrofitted and fixed... Interesting. I'm looking like I know what I want. It's um it's the hummingbird, which is something I made. I know I downloaded it and I could have sworn I put it into this folder before I started. Maybe it didn't go in. Hmm. Oh crap. Let me just check that I like stick it in this folder perhaps. Um Oh, well, that's the normal one. Alright, uh, let's just choose something. Let's choose the... Ambusher. I'm kind of interested to see what this is. Try to get everything spawned in at some point. At this point, people are submitting things faster than I can spawn them in. See? Yes, son of a bitch. This thing is retarded. Screw you. I did, is, did I, did I not set the, is this, this is set at the, I, see, that's what I mean. It's just like, nope, we're going to uh, spawn this right underneath us and wreck your ship. This is a submarine, maybe, by the looks of it, possibly. The ambusher, I mean, that kind of sounds like a submarine name. All metal, which is good. I feel like wooden things at this point kind of get blown apart pretty quick. So, well, he's, whoa, okay. While he's doing that, let's go ahead and see. Now, this is where there's going to be a prop. Um, well, once this is spawned in, then I can just split everything up and divide them into where I want to off screen. Like, I'm not, I don't see an option to just, yeah. <laughs> All right, well, yeah, I'm not really sure if this is a submarine or a boat. Ah, uh, these waves are like really, really kicking us about. Lots of missiles. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at those. Oh wow, look at all this other information that's been added. Camera, one turn frag. Oh wow, they just got built more. Two frag warheads. Very nice. Ah, this is pretty cool. Pretty damn cool. How close is he to being done? Eighty-three percent. And after this, I'm gonna end the video. I mean, this took a little longer than I thought, but this is still definitely shorter than a battle. Oh, wow. Can you color shields? Because this looks like a totally different color, unless it's just showing through the underneath. Like, can you color shields? I mean, that's pretty damn cool. That's really cool. Because you notice how these, this shield is a different color than the uh, the one on, like, the Mark V Aegis or whatever? This is really quite quite awesome. I like this thing. What, what are these? Ah, oh, crap. Well, guess I'm not gonna find out. These look like maybe, possibly, like, flares. Wow, this is pretty awesome. I'm taking it that this is a submarine. Um, let's go ahead and release it. We can find out pretty quick. Ah, oh, crap. I always do that. Alright, I'm gonna say it's a submarine. Where'd it go? Shit. I lost it. 
the fuck? Oh, I was looking the wrong direction. Never mind. Well, I'm not sure if this is a boat or a submarine. It's very hard to tell. Hmm. And I think it's going backwards. Or is it not? It's not going backwards. The shield's just pointed backwards. I think. Hmm. Huh. Okay, well, I'm going to end this here, guys. I'm going to divide all these into different fleets and put them where I want to um, off-screen before next episode. But I think that's going to be it. And next episode, we're going we're gonna to do a few battles. We're going to... One of these guys are going this way. going to maybe take this on or take this on and intercept them. We'll get in some good battles next time. So, as always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I do hope you enjoyed. I look forward to the next. But until then, I look forward to seeing you all, and do take care.